Hello everyone, this is Mimi Nava from Her Campus Sing. And today, um, I wrote a letter to my 16 year old self. Why, you may ask, because I'm only 15. I'm about to turn 20 in three months. Since November's almost over, well no, November, December, January, three months. And a few weeks. So I sat and I just looked back on everything that I've done, also when my mental state was at 16 versus me now, and how it has just drastically improved my self esteem. It's just evolved. And, you know, I just evolved as a person. I am half, almost halfway done with my second year commercial. I'm halfway, halfway there. To be very, very corny. I am almost halfway there. And it's just very, it's a lot to me because sometimes I sit and cry about the things that I sat and went through or sat and thought about. It was just, it's a lot of things that I just thought of myself that weren't very positive and I thought I would never get out of, thought I would never change. And I did. So, I'm really glad that y'all would get to get this letter and see my growth as a whole because I feel like every every person needs to reflect on themselves and write to themselves. Not so forth in this manner, but just journal their start of their journey to now. And I think that's very important because, you know, we can look back and think, dang. This is exactly how I felt. I wrote it, I said it, you know, I can't take it back. And that's very true, you can't. Okay, and as I start to read to you, this is my little journal. Create your own magic. I will one day discuss the importance of this journal, but today we're just gonna read from it, okay? To my 16 year old self, you're going to be very proud of the woman you blossomed into in about four years. You graduate to be an on-campus media personality, making a platform for herself as the lit selling go. You create a radio show that uplifts young brands, trying to make it in the world just like you. I know right now you are looking at me with the most shocked smile because you didn't think that highly of yourself. Trust me, you get over that very soon and realize who you truly are. The low self-esteem is a battle you finally conquered after going through the twists and turns high school threw at you. Now, you conquer college with, with such dignity and grace. Even though things may not go your way, you learn so much about yourself. You see yourself beyond the limits you placed yourself in. And yes, that little girl that felt like she was too much and always in the way is going to be properly used at the illustrious Clark Atlanta University. Through all the roller coaster of emotion, you gain your voice and you stand up tall and you speak proudly. Even though the darkness tries to creep back up, you never let it take you down. You are now halfway done with your second year of college and you have so many opportunities ahead of you. You make so many people proud, you impress so many instructors that you are highly thought of in your own field. Never forget that you are never too much. It's just the people that are in your space right now are never enough, and they never were. That's simply okay, because God has a place for you and is to progress beyond Rome, Georgia, that little prep school, and you will make your family and community so proud of you. Love, and sincerely love, we may not be 19 year old self, soon to be 20. Thank you all for watching this video. It is a little bit more serious than what I usually do, but I feel like this can be shared and this can also inspire people to self reflect because it is a very important thing we must do. Thank you and stay flourishing, my friends.